Yes, welcome. Welcome back. Welcome to the Circus of Values. What's our pick here? Stop being so quiet. Right, this is how I talk, Michael. Michael, what's the pick here? I want you to pick a card for us, Michael. Can you tell us what card to take? What? Michael, tell us what card to take. Huh? Michael, what card are we taking here? I don't know, Virgin Catacomb? Do you like that over Ashen Rider? Yes. Do you like it over uh, uh, Phyrexian Revoker? <laughs> yes. What about Cataxian Probe? Uh huh. What about Wall of Omen? You know, I'll take Cataxian Probe, why not? You know, it's too late, you sit for in Catacombs. I'll take that. I took the Virgin Catacombs. Mark. Can anyone even hear you? I don't know. Maybe maybe they can. Maybe they can't. You know what's what uh what's the thing with the stuff? More move desired cards here. You can then move cards to your sideboard. Your deck should have at least forty cards with fifteen, eighteen lands. Click submit deck when ready. Where's the submit deck button? Where's the submit deck button? Where is it? Submit to me. Scrubland. It's pretty early, Talarian. Is it? Mm -hmm. Is it? You could build around that SOB. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Mike just got Mike just got came to, came to life. See, this goes good with our first pick. This goes good with nothing. Do you understand? Fine. Take the scrubby land. No, I'll take this. What do you want me to take? You want me to take this? What do you want me to take this? I don't want all the. I don't want to have to pick every card. Why not? Because that always leads to bad experiences. What if this is the best experience you could get? Michael, we have 10 seconds. You better pick something, man. Academy. Okay. You did it. I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you. Now let's get punished. Nice. Got punished. This is punished? No. I guess not. <laughs> like, that's... This makes blue, man. I don't know if you knew that. Yes. But does it? Yeah. What? Yes, it does. But does it? Yeah. Oh, wow. But does it? I mean, it's probably Portal, but Primeval Titan? Oh, boy. How many six drops do you want? How many six drops do you want? Seven. Oh, got him. Oh, my God, dude. Seven six drops. Can someone call the burn unit? We're just going to do a good old-fashioned Sultai Artifact deck with six drops. What, what problem is? I guess none. And Simi. Yeah, that's good. Old Soap Bar. Simi. Irish Spring, boys. It's fresh as the the morning dew. Yeah. Off your, off your little jammies. Off your chinny chin chin. Okay. Well, both of our answers are pretty weird. So. <laughs> and if you guys are watching this on YouTube or on Twitch, you know you can head over to CoolStuffInc.com where you'll get five percent off with the promo code Frank Five. But also check out the article that went up today. It is called "The Return of Agro Loman Modern." And uh, leave me a comment on the article. Let me know what you think. I appreciate that kind of interaction. And that's what Father likes. I really appreciate that kind of interaction. Shut the hell up. I'm going to take this Karn. What about Tanglewire? Are you for real? Yeah, man. It goes good with our academy. It doesn't. Why not? Because it dies eventually, and Karn makes tokens that are good with our academy, too. Karn makes tokens that are good with our academy, Are we live? Are people watching us right now? <laughs> I don't know. I haven't seen chat talk in a while. It says we're offline. It says we're not communicating any kind of data right now. Oh, it does? That's really weird. I mean, we're still recording, so everybody, everything on YouTube is going to be fine, but... Boy, that's super weird, man. Uh, I wish I had. I wish there was like an error message that came up where I could be like, "Oh, this is the problem." What are we taking here? I guess actually, Scarab God seems amazing. All right. Well, oh, Nicol Bolas, we could splash that dude, right? 
right? No. I don't know what to do. This is really weird. I don't know. I, it's not like... <laughs> what if I hit this? Is this? Does this help us go live? I have no idea. I'll stop the recording here. What are you taking here, man? Nickel bolus. Okay, sounds good. All right. Liliana? Gross. All right, well, I'm going to stop the recording. And then we'll just pick it up after I restart OBS. All right, well, since last we met, we ended up picking up this Nicol Bolas. I believe this Scarab God, we might have had the Scarab God. We picked up a Nicol Bolas, a uh, Phantasmal Image, a Lumbering Falls, and a bunch of nonsense that we're not really going to be playing. And then we picked up a Black Lotus. So, all right, not too bad. That's pretty decent. We've also had Nicol Bolas on turn two before with Black Lotus. So let's see if we can do that again. All right, I like these eight cards. And uh, looks like we're okay. I have no idea what happened to OBS while I was gone. That was very strange. Indeed. And hopefully the gap in between the videos and the stream and all that is uh, still okay. I'm going to take Mana Drain. Lotus into Mana Drain seems good, right? It's all right. So if you guys are still there, definitely let us know. Please shout into the void. Shout into the void. Shout. Shout. Into the void. This is Mike B, and he's kind of a shone. Wow. Shout. I want to take Overgrown Tomb. Do you like that? Is that what Father likes? Father is okay with it. Well, we haven't seen any chat messages. Well, we are live. 100% live, right? We just have zero viewers. I guess. I don't know what's going on, man. The internet's hard. We can also just cut Primeval Titan and play Grixis. So we have one green card and one red card. We also have Simic Signet and uh, Lumbering Falls, Verdant Catacomb, and Overgrown Tomb, all of which help the Sultai uh, portion of our draft. What are you doing over there? You doing okay? Scratching my toe. Your toe? Yeah. Did you have a niche on your toe? I did. How's that going for you? Okay, it's been scratched. That's really good, man. I'm really proud of you. Thank you. Just kidding. I hate you. Wow. Wow. That's a pretty late opposition. Wow. Although we don't look like an opposition deck. Yeah, you don't think so? You don't think we're making a bunch of tokens and putting them into play? How about this Oracle of Moldiah? Moly Dilly? I wonder if the chat died. I wonder if... Our, I wonder if... I wonder if our whole life died. Maybe we were in a, in a void. Maybe we are in a void. In between time and space. <laughs> I, yeah, I think that's actually probably the most likely situation is that we're in a void. We have 17 viewers apparently. Between time and space. I have no idea what's going on. This is a really weird, this is a really weird uh, stream experience. I like Remand. Sure. Ooh, control magic. I like that. That's what Father likes. You see anything else that you like better? No. Okay. We're very hairy blue here. I don't know how good this Talarian Academy is, but I do know... No, man, it taps for blue. Oh, that's right. It does tap for blue. Oh, Botanic. Why do you keep mentioning High Tide every time it shows up? <laughs> I like Hostage Sticker, too. I just like High Tide, okay? Yeah, man, that's fine. I'm going to put this guy on the sideboard for now. How dare you? Yeah, well. You son of a Mitch. Oh, look, we're back. Oh, which one is it? Which one is it? Which one is it? Probably Crassy. You think so? Over Vivian Reed? Yeah. Why'd you even ask me? I just like to hear your opinions, man. 
I'm fine to hear you be by I don't, I don't see us getting a million mana to play a uh, Hydroid Crassus. Why don't you make your son happy? Because, because I hate him. That's why. Because that's he's... what father likes. Oh, we're gonna just gonna main deck this thing. Uh, Incubation Druid or Wall of Roots? Probably Wall of Roots, right? They're both pretty good. I like Wall better because it can survive a Toxic Deluge. Sometimes. We got Knight of Autumn, Knight of the Reliquary. We got a bunch of green white knights. Oh, wow. I'll take an Edric. Sure. I'll take a Plague Crash. All, all these cards are fine. That's what Father likes. We have a lot of good green white cards over here, too. Selfless Spirit, Silverlight Paladin. I hate. This is the land I hate the most. And we've seen Blooming Marsh. The land I hate the most. <laughs> why did I sound? Why did you make me Irish? I don't know. Oh, it's the land you hate the most, laddie. Um, I think it's still this. Yeah, that's what I take. That's what father would take. That it's a mistake there. to not take what father would like. F would lake? like? Like, 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 like. <laughs> Orzhov's Signet? God, this Slain Academy sucks in our deck. Oh, Shardless Agent seems great, but we have two counter spells, so it actually seems terrible. It's either Hissing Quagmire, Reclamation Sage, Konama's Reach, or Orzhov's Signet. I'm gonna take Reach. You like Reach? Yeah. Reach him and Breach him. Oh, Polluted Delta. Yes. I really like Vraska. We have two six drops that are great, and Polluted Delta is Chef's Kiss. <laughs> um, I do want a blue fetch land for this, but we do have Overgrown Tomb, so Polluted Delta is a try land. Spooky, scary, moochal beasts and shivers down your spine. What are we eating for dinner, Michael? I don't know. What's this? Let's go here. That's not a restaurant. It isn't? No, you dumb shit. <laughs> <laughs> what is it then? It's Green Chef. Why don't you read it? Do you ever read? you ever read, Michael? I'm gonna take this mail from Paul. Oh, this is one of those like meal services. I there you go. You. I got you. Jeez. Well, you got a Carabas letter over here. Oh, a letter? Yeah. A Carabas letter? See inside for special offers. See in? Did you see the si inside? I didn't. I have no idea what my computer did. I don't know what happened, man. But we're back now, so please, you know, refresh or whatever. Refresh or come back. I don't know what to tell you. Hero's Downfall's nice. Sure. Frosty's nice. Yeah. Alright, Hero's Downfall it is. Please open the letter, read it out loud. Okay. Hey man, don't don't read my private letter from Carabas. <laughs> I hate Tassiger. I think Tassiger is a trash card. I'm gonna take Lotai Cobra. This is really like a letter. I don't want to read all that. Okay, I'll read it. Here you go. Let's read this this Caraba's letter. Oh, Psalm Simulacrum seems gas. When Johnny Caraba and his uncle Damien Mandola <laughs> opened the first Carabas, they spent months perfecting their family's recipes, ensuring each and every entree was just right. There's a reason why some of our most iconic dishes like spaghetti and meatballs or lasagna have been on the menu since day one. But more than just using family recipes, we also treat our guests like family. And sometimes that means sending you home with something special for tomorrow. Just like Johnny's grandmother, Mama Mandola would have. It is my pleasure to keep this tradition going by offering, by offering the opportunity to bring homemade home. For, join us for dinner and you can take home your choice of any entree with super salad for just $10. Come in and see what the true Italian hospitality feels like. Ask me by name when you visit. Russell Prowler, proprietor of Caraba's Italian Grill. Thank you. <laughs> that was definitely worth it. Spooky, scary. I don't want another four drop, but I like this Garrick a lot. I actually think it's Garrick. This stick's looking spicy. This is a solid twenty-three. I hope we can get a. I hope an underground sea is is next. Wouldn't that is be great? next? I hope our underground sea is next. I'd really like it to be next.
you know? Thank you. 42 Nonsense. Thank you so much for the buddy. Welcome back. Keep up the great work. Your kindness really, truly appreciate Your support is truly appreciated. Got him. See that? He tried to compliment me and say your, your content. What was a sucker. Like, how dare you? Your support is appreciated. I like Batter Skull more than Ooze in this deck. Yeah, we want to gain life. Oh, Charlotte's agent? Again nope. with the two counter good. spells? Dang. Maybe it's Nighthawk? Sure. I don't think we're playing it, but yeah. Why do you hate your mother? Why do you hate? Father. Why must you hate? Why do you hate father? Why has hate it consumed you, father? What? What? Are you drunk? Maybe. Are you sober? Are you scrober? Are you Bober Dad? Oh, the Vraska came back? <laughs> did da deal boy! Um, what are you taking here? You have my elder, Vampire Hex Mage, Kitchen Mix? Hmm? Hmm? Probably Finksy Boy. Good for the aggro matchup. There's an aggro matchup? Huh. Something. Are they playing Mono Red? It's really good. I have never seen that before. You've never seen Mono Red? I don't know what you're saying right now. What about Mono White? I'm pretty sure you're stroking out right now. Wow, these are some these are three late white cards. We have to make two cuts. Toxic Dealers can go from the main because we're kind of a midi range deck. I also don't like Liliana Dust Majesty at all. Yeah, get that out of here. And we're done. stupid. Gonna leave this Talarian Academy on the sideboard. Like the trash it is. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Nope, three, four, five, six. And yeah, definitely going to seven here. Uh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Four, five, six, seven, eight. And yeah, we can cut one of these guys. I like it. I'm in. I'm in it to la win it. This deck seems fantastic, and if you don't like it, you can die. <laughs> wow. Caraba's Italian Grill, a tale as old as time. Wow. Caraba and his uncle Damien Mandola opened the first Carabas. They spent months perfecting their family's recipes, <laughs> ensuring each and every entree was just right. There's a reason why some of our most iconic dishes, like spaghetti and meatballs or lasagna, have been on the menu since day one. But more than just using family recipes, we also treat our guests like family. And sometimes that means sending you home with something special for tomorrow. Just like Johnny's grandmother, Mama Mandola would have. It is my pleasure to keep this tradition going by offering, by offering the opportunity to bring homemade home. Join us for dinner and you can take home your choice of any entree with super salad for just $10. Come in and see what the true Italian hospitality feels like. Ask me by name when you visit. Russell Prowler, proprietor of Caraba's Italian Grill. Nope, don't like that. Thank you. Yep, like that. When Johnny Caraba and his uncle Damien... Oh, God. And <laughs> He's just starting again. Um, I'll keep that on top. So, we could go turn one Lotus Land Simulacrum. But that seems pretty Doesn't terrible. Seem worth it. No, or we can just wait and play a turn two Vivian. Seems better. Or we could play a turn three Vraska. It's true. Or we can play a turn three Signet into Karn. Oh wow, that resolved. That seems fantastic. I'm gonna take the land. <laughs> I'll take the land. Your Planeswalker seems worse than mine. Because yours sucks. Wow. Got him. I'll take a Verdante Catacombos. See. What do you, do you even know, Mama Mandela? You stupid idiot. 
I don't know Mama Mandola now. Yeah, well. Wait, wait, you say now? Did you once? Yeah. I once knew her. But no longer. Are you really- are you serious? Bitch, are you for real? Well, we are one turn away from Vraskaing this and getting our Vivian Reed back. It's so ironic that Vivian Reed can kill enchantments, yet she gets busted by an enchantment. You think she could break it from the inside, you know? Yeah. Totally. Do you not agree with my assessment? I don't agree with anything you've ever said in your life. That's really cold. You're a cold mo- mofo. You're a cold mother trucker. You're a cold ice road mother trucker. You remember that show, Ice Road Mother Truckers? Yeah, man. It was great. Well, I agree. Gotta shuffle that plate crafter away, right? I'll shuffle you away, you stupid turtle. I take offense to that. Good. Good. Excellent. Oh, that's good. I want to draw a forest. Like you do. Island. Polluted Delta. Oh, Scrabble God. Can I resolve this? Over oh, wow. Thank you. That's pretty impressive. Impolity, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. I'll take Scrabble God. Scrabble McMrabbles. We have one, two, three mana, so we can't actually do anything else. I guess I'll attack. Why not? This is where they threw the breach. Emrakul kill us. End of turn. Through the breach. Factor fiction. All right, that's fine. Well. These are both pretty good. Pretty, pretty, pretty good. Well, I don't want to give you through the breach and... Oh, they kept through the breach. Well, shit. That's scary. That's not good. Is this blight still closed? If it's actually just Emrakul, it's not terrible. <sighs> you gotta be fucking kidding me. I guess we shouldn't have attacked. Where's our bribery at? You got me. Turn to Lotus Vivian and to Vraska get Vivian back. Mulligan. Reluctantly keep. Radioactive cookies in Russia? I have no idea. Cookie. I'm sorry, what? Chernobyl Bobby Butter Biscuits. Hmm. Everybody knows that, Michael. So when did this guy have all the colors? I mean, everybody can paint with all the colors of the wind, Michael. Not everybody. What about those with... You know, never mind. Yeah. Exactly. I'm going to Manalik your Edric this... Okay, sure. I wonder what he got. I guess we'll never know. Probably a forest. Wasteland. 
That seems really good. And you're like 30 deck. color deck? So greedy. Sure, dude. Oh, how nice. Five color wasteland, I guess, was what we're playing against. Let me guess, the only creature in your deck is Blightsteel Colossus. Of course it is. Is that just like the top card of our deck? That's interesting. God, I'd love to be able to get rid of this guy, but... I think we're dead. This is so dumb, dude. Feels awesome to just have it all every single time. That's gotta be super cool. I would love to have an experience like that on Magic Online where I just like have it all. That'd be super awesome. <clears throat> Only opponents can have that, Frank. Oh, through the breach and Blightsteel. I had it to my hand this time. Oh, I got Oath of Druids on two turn and I go Wasteland Blue and then I'll just get Blightsteel again. Mm -hmm. Seems good. Must be uh, must be great. I had Lotus. I had Lotus into Vivian Raid, but apparently that's too that's some fair bullshit. Uh, Vivian can destroy artifacts, however, when the artifact is indestructible, it is a lot harder to do. This is where you want to get uh, Tropical Island. Alright. Well, we're going to play this. Probably going to get a green source, even though we want a blue source. So. Can Michael paint with all the colors of the wind? Nope, only a couple of them. How many? Seven? Three. Three? Yeah. It's like nothing. Oh my god. Mono indestructible creatures, guys. Mono indestructible creatures. I'm having a good time. How about you? Island off the top one time. Blue source. Green source. Fucking fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. Do it again. See if I care. Now they just take control magic and it's just game over. Like, it doesn't do... Like, we're just done. Oh, they mana drain. Because they have thoughts <laughs> as well. <laughs> yeah. Cool. <sighs> Yeah. <laughs>
Boy, everything about this stream has been just absolute quality. We should have brought Toxic Deluge against the Blightsteel deck last time. Yeah. Always a pleasure. I guess I'll play first. Let's keep it. I really, it's like tropical, not having a, a blue source or a blue black source is really, really obnoxious. Because like we just can't get it, we can't play two of our spells. We have to get just an island. It's just... Yeah, right. Well, they have Thoughtseize and Duress, so the odds of us keeping anything in our hand is pretty low. So, How you doing over there? What are we eating for dinner, man? Chicken. We're eating chicken. Chickens. Multiple chickens. Several. Several chickens. Do you get those buffalo blasts? I get them every single week, man. Every week? Yes. From where? From the from Craft Street Kitchen, the place that has them. Where else would I get them from? Yeah, don't just shut Rick up. Rainbow Cafe. Rick Rainbow Cafe. <laughs> I didn't say Rick. <laughs> what? I just said Rainbow Cafe. <laughs> Where'd you <laughs> add the Rick from? Rick Rainbow Cafe. Who's... Someone clip it. See, did I say Rick? <laughs> I don't think I did. I heard a noise before you said Rainbow Cafe. Maybe you did. You got R Rainbow Cafe. I might have done that. Okay, see, that's what I heard. I heard Rick. Oh, look, we can do things. Until they counter it, maybe, perhaps. How are we ahead right now? Because they didn't do their broken shit yet, I guess. All right, well, I'll... they're going to bury you alive first. <laughs> well, we're already being buried alive in this matchup, so. Okay, I'll sacrifice a creature. Discard a card, huh? I want to play the Vivian. I want to kill this. Yeah, we're just going to get reforest here. Oh, you gotta give me a primeval sign or a consecrated sphinx? Deal. Good choice. All three six drops got ex exiled, so that's pretty cool. Alright, well. Man, these, uh. <sighs> these first two games. Wait! Never mind, I'm an idiot. I knew it. <laughs> Whatever, Rick Rainbow Rainbow where? Cafe. Oh, Rick Rainbow Cafe. Where is the what's the cafe called in Animal Kingdom? I'm pretty sure it's Rainbow Cafe. So that's the one you're thinking of? That's the one you're talking about? It might be Rainforest Cafe. Rainforest Cafe, I think yeah. that's it, yeah. I don't even know if that's still around anymore. I do know it was overpriced. But that's Disney for you. That's messed up that you would even say that. Look, there's multiple. Lake Buena Vista. Lake Buena Vista. Yeah. There's a couple of them in uh, in Orlando. Orlandy McShandy. Do you know of Orlandy McShandy? No. Michael, let me tell you about Orlandy McShandy. Please don't. Michael, please listen to... I don't want to. Okay, well, that's too bad. 
Karn's up to like eight. That's so much, dude. What was the other card you hit? Phantasmal image? Oh, we're getting that dude back. Bow show next turn. What do you think of Primeval Titan here, huh? How do you feel about that guy? I feel like you slam it. Do you? Slam it, jam it. What up, big pimps? Lumbering and Blooming Marsh. Activated you, played you, played a land, did the things. Oh boy. Well, I was really looking forward to getting my uh, Phantasmal image back, but I guess that's never going to happen, so in my face, I guess. Or ask the grinning bobcat why he grins. Can what? Ask the grinning bobcat why he grins. Okay? Okay. I'll do that. A ask him, Michael. Hey, somebody clipped it. Oh, let's see. I want to hear it. Weak, Where man. Look at those buffalo blasts. I get them every single week, man. Every week? Yes. Yeah. From where? From the from Craft Street Kitchen, the place that has them. Where else would I get them from? Yeah, don't just shut Rick up. Rick Rainbow Cafe? Rick Rainbow Cafe? <laughs> <laughs> you say Rick. <laughs> it totally says... It totally <laughs> sounds like Rick Rainbow Cafe. Where else would I get them from? Yeah, don't just shut Rick up. Rainbow Cafe. Rick Rainbow Cafe. <laughs> <laughs> it's hilarious because of how much it sounds like that. That's amazing. You want to go to Sunny Rick Rainbow Cafe? Oh God, Scarab God seems nuts here. More like Scary God. More like Scary God. <laughs> Why is he so scary? Because the Rick Rainbow Cafe. <laughs> that is a good reason. Or ask the grinning bobcat why he grins. Okay. Ask him. Hey, Rick Rainbow Cafe, Forest Cafe cat, why you grin? <laughs> <laughs> beautiful, Michael. Just beautiful. I think they played. They played this bone shard. I think I could kill this hostage taker because that would have been a good play. But it did, it did not. They did not do that. They did not. That's hilarious to me that it, it's very clearly you, not clearly, but you can you can clearly hear something that sounds like Rick Rainbow Cafe. Yeah, it was just an accident, but it was definitely a Rick. But it's funny because you didn't even realize that you're like, I didn't say that. No, buddy, you said Rick Rainbow. Yeah, it's it's on the tape. I can't dispute it. It is on the tape. Heroes downfall on. God, I'm so tired of your, your hatred for my life. I don't want this toxic deluge though, so I'm gonna just ship it away. Ship, ship, ship it away. Oh, look, it's the same toxic deluge. Not a bug, guys. It's a feature. Pretty good feature. It's not. You don't like it? No one likes it. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Why are you like this? Ask the grinning bobcat why he grins, Michael. No. If you don't ask him... I won't do it. He's going to be very sad. You can't make me. God, why are you like this? We got Bone Shredder in the graveyard. And I have... Removal Tootins. Tootins seems good. 
Yeah, but we have one land left in the deck, so... So what? Now we have zero lands in the deck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. I guess we have two lands, le three lands left in the deck. Let's find them. One, two... Did they leave the game? They left the game, so... There's two basics. What else we got? I think those are the two, right? Maybe? Oh yeah, because we only have 16 lands in a Lotus. In a low tie. Should we fix our mana base to bring in Ligon and Relic Order? When Definitely. they have... Mm -hmm. I don't see any problems with that. Me neither. You got a Black Lotus. That's basically free. It's You're right. It's basically just free splash. Just put it right in. Where is Rainbow Cafe? Would you say, Michael? Michael! Under the... Under the sea? Under the... Under the sea. <laughs> oh, the Rainbow Cafe, man. Under the sea. Uh-oh. Did we turn one Kodama's Reach? Man. Killer. <laughs> God, you really know how to party. Did you keep his hand? Yeah, what's wrong with his hand? It does nothing. I think it does some things. Like what? Merman, Kodama's Reach, all the, all the things, man. Pack ready. Well, I got Deluge for you. Can you paint with all the colors of the Rick's Rainbow Forest Cafe? Yeah, oh, geez, Morty. <laughs> you really need to learn how to paint with all the colors of me, Morty. Needs three more burps in there. Oh, dang, they're going to discard a Grave to Toodles. Great. Grave toodles! Why do you taste so good now? I kind of like Vraska here. Off of Lotorus. What does that even do? No, nah, it doesn't. I want to tax this Deluge, but I'm going to keep... I'd wait. They're going to reanimate. Well, it's not going to Toxic Deluge. I don't want to get, I don't want to get double ratted here. I want to take four, right? Do I? Probably six, actually. So, well, if they discard something, if you take four and then we take another six from this, we're taking ten, we're going to eight. That's a lot. Are you some kind of little Mitch? <sighs> like, they could also have, like, a discard spell. We've seen Duress and Thoughtseize. Thoughtseize yeah. yeah. So then, we'll lead it up. Because also if they play Grave Titan, I'll just Hostage Taker it and and cast it. I'm going to play Lotus, though, because they might want to remand something, I guess. Man, what a broken spell. Crack Lotus remand. Whew. Doesn't get much better than that, boys. <laughs> that is peak. Oh, fascinating. That is peak Lotus usage right there. I just want to have the option open. I don't want to do it. I just want to know it's there. Hmm. Alright, they have three cards in hand. Oh, they're not going to do anything. Corpse Dance is good. Oh, I like just Solemn Simulacrum here, right? Yeah. Get a second blue source. This is where they go EOT corpse. Oh, no corpse dance. Would this be the top card or would this be the top card? I can't actually tell. This is the top card, right? Bone Shredder? Yeah. Okay. That's good. So I don't care about corpse dance. This round two? We got crushed round one. We're doing better this round, but I'm still getting tired of getting blown out by fat 12 mana colorless creatures like this friggin' idiot. You can Hosh take her, right? Well, I s yes, but we're never going to be able to cast it. Why not? Well, because it costs 10 mana. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. I guess we're closer than... Corpse dance. Corpse dance. Corpse dance. Da, 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 oh, it gets haste. Yeah. Yeah, that's rough. Oh, no, boys. Guess we're going to end eight cards in the library. Yeah, I'm not sure if we can win with that, though, is the problem. Uh, yeah, 
maybe. I mean, what do we? What's the alternative though? Like we ran it, they do it next turn. Yes. And then we go to seven cards because of Solemn Simulacrum. And then we go to six cards for our draw. Do so we have like any alternative to this? It's rough. Maybe you just take the hit? I don't know. I don't think so. Because next time we can play Vraska. <laughs> I mean, we have to hit a land, I guess. All right, we did. We can play Vraska, make a guy which puts Vraska up to eight, and I think being able to pump Vraska uh, and and put their life total to one is probably a good enough win condition. So if they want to spend their turn again corpse dancing here, that's fine. Because then we're just going to plus Vraska. We're going to block, plus Vraska, make a token. Next turn we'll put them to one. <sighs> Magic. Or they just heroes downfall that. You know, whatever whatever you feel like. And now we have nothing really. I really don't even want Kodama's reach here because then we go down to 23 cards then Willamog literally just destroys us. Good point. Yeah, this is so stupid. Well, sometimes you just lose because magic is cruel. I guess we're just taking 10. I wish you had a different creature in your graveyard on top of the Ulamog, but here we are. They didn't do it. Right, because they can just do it at our end step, I guess. We have six power on board. Oh, they didn't they didn't do it then either. Alright, well. I think they just have to do it. Him to Torok. Sure. Come on, Koda. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> oh, Lord. Having a good time. What are you doing? We're having a good time. I mean, that would be in a position where they have to block soon. They have three cards. We know one is a corpse dance. So... And we almost have Leith. Are we just going to win through, like, having dirtily two two power creatures? Apparently. This seems okay. They discarded the corpse dance. And living death. Yikes. Well, neither of these can kill anything, and Shriekma has to kill something. So Shriekma literally has to target their Emrakul, which is pretty amazing. So does Bone Shredder. <laughs> All right, well, that's the thing, I guess. What can we... One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, they can target their Emrakul, I guess. Yeah, never mind. That's sad. How much mana do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We have nine with the Garrick. Oh, boy. 
How many card types in our graveyard? Artifact, creature, enchantment, planes. Oh, we're just gonna we're just gonna take the Emrakul and cast it. Yeah, I will draw now. Can we get rid of this bone shirt? Does Emrakul trample? Oh, it does, doesn't it? Yes. Mm -hmm. So what is it? What do we got here? Sorcery, artifact, instant, planeswalker, enchantment, creature. So we have six types. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I don't know if this does enough though. I don't think it does. Good blocker. Actually, they get an extra turn. But we get their turn. Alright, so hold on. Let's make a beast. Artifact and or black creatures. Sure. Well, we're not attacking here. All right. Buried alive. Uh, place your upkeep abilities on the stack. Now we're not going to pay for that. No. Definitely bizarre them. Well, then they draw two and discard three. Sure, I guess that's fine. Oh, gasoline! How much? I'll pay for life. <laughs> Got <you. laughs> oh, that's fantastic. That's amazing. Wow. All right, we did it. I'm not sure if we could have won that game. I don't know. I didn't do the math. Like, it's possible we could have run some of their guys into our Emrakul and our Beast. Like, run Packrat. Um, maybe run Grave Titan into... No, probably not. Because we can just block the Grave Titan the next... And Grave Titan has Death Touch, so we're not doing that. Block Shriek Maw with Hostage Taker. We still, boys. I like it when I type things. I type responses. Even though I know you're watching so you can hear me. All right, one one. I think our deck is good. I just think it's very fair. It's a fair deck, yeah, unless it's a you on the fair side. unless you draw the the turn one lotus into turn two five mana guy. Oh, Spencer, we uh, we bizarre of Baghdadded and hit toxic deluge, and then they killed themselves by paying for life. Oh my god. Of course we play goalie again. Unbelievable. Oh my god, that's amazing. This hand is terrible though. We are gonna mulligan. And give me green. Give me green. I said that's not that's a green card give me a, a, a card that produces green mana oh dang hey man do we take that kitchen things I thought we did maybe we didn't that's no it. wait we didn't take it no we didn't I'm just I'm messing with you because we didn't yeah you thought it was funny then now look who's laughing who buddy we got island and swamp yeah so what 
I'm just saying. We, I mean, we can't cast Kitchen Finks anyway, you stupid muppet. Well, not with that belief system. <laughs> hey, man. Oh, that cast system. Are we going to Rick's Rainbow Cafe tonight or what? Yes, obviously. Unbelievable. So read this. Uh, and this this is my comment. He does, yeah. <laughs> like for real, dude, hundred percent. Green. Solemn simulacrum. I'm tempted to just conceive because I'm currently trying to juggle this game, a work call, and shit talking you, and I just honestly don't know that I have it all in me. I don't think this is this isn't even shit. This this is like the worst shit talking I've ever seen. <laughs> you stupid muppet! I did say. <laughs> I don't. I don't know why muppet is such a funny insult because I I love muppets themselves. I love the muppets, but like, what does it mean? Like, what are you saying to someone when you call them a muppet? You know what's the weird part about this picture? Yeah. This guy kind of looks eerily like my dad, my actual dad. Without, like, but my actual dad's fatter without as many tattoos. How many does your dad have? Okay. Uh, one. Well, got one? What is it? So. Is it a, is it a tribal one? I don't remember what it is. Is it a, is it a, does he have a little butterfly on his, on the small of his back? <laughs> yeah. It's a butterfly <laughs> on the small of his back. You, you nailed it, man. Good job. Well, that's cool, man. Yeah, everybody, get, 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 get what you like. You get your own tattoos, you know? That's not even... So, what's the, what's the word I'm looking for? Alright, we're dead unless we hit a brrr, green source. Green source. In the something. middle of our street. I think we pulsed the Jitte. Jitte is going to make our life Yeah, it's going to be pretty hard to give plus four, plus four. Our house. In the middle of our schmeet. In the middle of our schmeet. Okay, so the reason Muppet is such a great insult is that it's something silly and generally inoffensive. So you're really diminishing. Jitte, make the life shitte. That's true. <laughs> that is true. If we hit one more land, we can go Wall of Roots into Plague Crafter. Oh, that's not good. That's fine. We got two. We got two things to deal with it. If we can hit lands, we got one more thing. Our house in the middle of our street. Oh, they're gonna dash him. Dash him and crash him. Wait, I thought they dashed him. No, you dash cost two. You stupid muppet. God, I'm like, eh. I thought he paid two. He had this cost two. How oh. many? How's he gonna have two left? You stupid muppet. <laughs> Stop calling me that. I'm just going to go to the next game. This is not a... You think we we could have beat them? No, they did have seven on board, though, so maybe not. I'm going to bring in Toxic Deluge and Vampire Knight Hizzle. I'm going to take out Edric. I'm going to take out one of these six drops, probably prime time. Really? Yeah, I mean, what's the, is this better than... I mean, if we have six mana, we don't really need prime time, right? And, like, Consecrated Sphinx draws us things. What about... What if you go get those gain lands, though? I don't have any gain lands. Do well, you, that's because you're stupid. Do you even lift? You built incorrectly. God. You're not getting those gains, bro? Huh. Fascinating. Sounds awkward. Why? It just doesn't. It just doesn't. <sighs> doesn't really do much. You know, like turn one Karn into like just start drawing a million cards. I like that a lot. I like it a lot. Hunters having dreams.
All right. We did it. Turn one, Karn. Turn one, Hostage Taker's also pretty good. Get that Beats. B -b 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 beats at Rick's Rainbow Cafe. Ladies and gentle people. Oh, they're going to give me the batter skull? Oh, they give me the wall of roots. Oh, that's so juicy. That's juice. Mike was juice. Well, I don't think they'll ever give you a batter skull. You don't think so? Pretty hard to do. Can I just get it next turn? Yes. What problem is, Michael? I don't think this game is going to be even close. Oh, wow. Flame Slash? What just happened? I don't know. I'm confused. No blocks. I thought it was fine. <laughs> no blocks. Pass. That was a good. That was good. I made them discard. Did you see that? That was good. Yeah, I'll just keep revealing. I ain't too proud. Keep revealing. It <laughs> feels all right. Keep revealing. <laughs> Let's just play Salami, salami sim Simulacrum here. Salami Simulacrum. He's yep. got the salami for your mommy. <laughs> <laughs> That was awkwardly sexual, <laughs> Michael. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. You can't be saying he got the salami for your mommy. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> it was hilarious. Holy God. <sighs> I'll keep this. This is now, this is an awkward hand. Unless we top deck a lotus. Holy schmagolies. Oh, no one drop is nice. Okay, Karn, I see you. This is why I watch the stream. For the salami for your mommy, obviously. <laughs> Give me that mommy salami. Give me a black land, please. Give me that sweet meat. Okay, stop it. You need to stop it right now. You're out of control. <laughs> what is this? Lightning strike your face. Fire me. That's worse, but fine. Okay, okay. I can work with this. Gotta okay. discard something. Let's get rid of Plague Crafter. Yeah, for sure. We counter something with Powder Skull? Get out of here, man. Or they don't play anything. I guess we're taking two then. They didn't play anything. It's getting worse. That's how they get you. This is how they get. They're just like I'll never play. Just never play another thing ever again. Shut up and Apparently, take red panda bear. Thank you so much. I got the salami for your mommy right here. Oh god. Nope. That's not gonna happen. I. Well, we can play <laughs> thank you so much for the donation. Even though, uh, I really hope you don't actually have the salami from for my mommy. What did you say? <laughs> you can play a Sphinx next turn. Salami Simulacrum. He's got the salami for your mommy. <laughs> <laughs> like oh. the cadence, really. Oh, hold on. Let's see what this link is. He's got the salami for your mommy. Yeah, the, the you're, yeah, you're, you're, yeah, it sounded good. <laughs> Oh, that's classic. Oh, how much mana do you get? Five whole manas? Seven mana total? We can actually just play Batter Skull and keep her manned up, which seems nuts, right? Yeah, that's pretty good. I don't think they can beat that. Or we can play Oracle five, six, seven. No, man, just slam that skull. We could okay, hear hear me out. If we have it if we if we play Oracle and hit two lands. No. Okay. <laughs> If we play Oracle... No. And hit two lands, yeah, the odds are not in your favor. 
the odds will may the odds oh what is it whatever it is it's going back to your salami mommy far away from here in this dark cold hotel room in the end you know if you sing the arms of the angel right yeah now, that's the song that he linked when I, I know but you don't gotta sing it man i don't have demonetized. to monetize i choose to by singing it you might get demonetized i'll demonetize i'll demonetize you with my song <laughs> <laughs> oh god you made a real mess all right, so next time we're gonna four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we go to six, but that's fine. In the arms of the salami. Oh, that's not good. I don't like it. Father doesn't like. I liked it better when I could gain life off of this card. Now I feel bad. I think we're dead now. Oh boy. Overgrown tomb. Say no. Untap. Crying out loud. Lotus, 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 Lotus. Hero's downfall. We only have a single black. That is a negative bueno. Nice. A little salami for the mommy. All right, so if we hit a land off the top, we can play Vraska, kill a Sulfuric Vortex, and gain some life. This is not going to go well. We do get a blocker. Oh, we don't. Oh, we know we're drawing this. This is pretty brutal. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. We go to one. Ugh, that's ugly. That's ugly. We know we're drawing this. Ten, eleven. If there's a land, we get to kill this. Attack for four, and then we have two guys up. So we go to five. But it has to be a land, otherwise we're dead. Yeah, but like, what's our alternative? Our alternative is like blocking here, going, taking seven, then taking one more hit from this, going to nine, and then we go to three. So going to three instead of one. But also getting a guy off the board. We get our, we get our germ back. And then we get one more turn to hit a land. I think it's got to be no blocks here. Yeah, I think no blocks is correct. It feels so bad. I'm really, I'm really hoping for a land, please. I don't want to die to this. Of course, the very next card is also one that would kill the Sulfuric Vortex. Because of course it is. <sighs> Vortex is a hell of a card. What? Vortex is a hell of a card. It sure is. Four, five, six. We can also deal four, five, six, seven, eight, nine here. <gasps> Wait, we just killed him. Oh yeah. Hey, look at that. Oh, did we find the line? Unless they have an incident of their upkeep. Oh my goodness gracious! I think he should have went through his upkeep. Oh wait, no, he wouldn't draw. He could die before he draws. That's right. He's got three cards, but I mean, like, apparently he knows that he doesn't have it. Oh man, good times, good times. Wow! Woo! Woo! Who indeed? Woo! I'm so mad at you! <laughs> Don't blame me, buddy. Blame your blame your business call. Got him. Also, Mike has some salami for your mommies. <laughs> you missed that meme. But uh, I have the salami thank for you your mommy. Thank you guys for watching. Apologize for the hiccups earlier. Hopefully you guys didn't miss too much. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. If you're watching on Twitch, I'm not leaving it. But if you're watching on YouTube, definitely uh, head to coolstuffinc.com. Head to manatraders.com. Head to meundies.com slash franklapore. All those links are in the description below. They're great ways to support the channel. And they all are fine, fine products. You can find the promo codes and the links and the salamis for your mommies down below in the description. I will see you guys next time. Appreciate the support. Thanks for watching.